Let me ask you, as the Bank of, of uh, England governor and as the Bank of Canada governor, do you think the other, the central banks recently uh, figured out that inflation was uh, more serious than it was too late? Or do you think they recognized early on it was going to be serious, they just didn't do enough about it? Uh, no, I think in hindsight, um, they realized it too late. Uh, they were operating under the old paradigm, if you will, that it was an issue of not enough demand, and that is something that works well generally until you have a bunch of supply shocks. And we had a COVID supply shock, we had an energy supply shock, we had supply shocks uh, with supply chains, geopolitics, all of which meant that there was more than transitory uh, inflation. And it took a while for uh, some of the central banks to uh, fully recognize that and start to respond. Right. Now that they have did recognize it, do you think they've done enough and do you see any more rate increases likely to come about? There are many people in the market who think that maybe another rate increase in the United States is likely. What do you think about that? Yeah, well, first, first part of the question, I think that once they started to move, and particularly when the Fed started to move, uh, it did respond in a very effective manner. Uh, it's, it consistently surprised people with its, uh, how resolute it was uh, and what it was prepared to do. Uh, it recognized that the bigger risk was that inflation stayed high or, or, or worsened. Um, and, uh, and it has put us in a position, put the U.S. in a position, uh, where inflation is increasingly under control, not totally under control. Uh, and that gets to the second part of your question, uh, which is, I, I, you know, if I have to choose a camp, I'd be in the camp of, uh, I expect that there will be a bit more tightening uh, by the Fed, um, so probably an additional uh, rate increase this year. But what's as important, in fact, what's more important is the path of policy over the course of the next 12 to 18 months. And I think it's finally beginning to be recognized. It's been a painful few weeks for some in the market in getting this recognition that it's not just about where the rate is today. It's not just about the peak, but it's the path. Yeah. And the path of rates uh, is very much, uh, and I've been of this view for a while, higher for longer, in order to ensure that policy is adequately tight to bring inflation fully back to that 2%.